Mr. Council. On September 29th and 30th, officers participated in the second of their two weapons, uh, annual weapons qualification, as I've reported in the past. This is something that we're required to do uh, twice each year. And I'm sure you've read about it or heard about it by now, but uh, on September 22nd, an officer responded to uh, an assault incident, which unfortunately resulted in a 59-year-old man dying. Um, this has obviously been a pretty extensive investigation for our department. Fortunately, we've received quite a bit of investigative assistance from the Sheriff's Department, so I'm grateful for that. And maybe Councilman I know can answer this better than I can, but uh, I don't believe that we've had a homicide in this community since uh, since the late 1980s, Jim? I did. Certainly, since I've been here very long. So uh, it's been a long time. And is, it a, is it still an ongoing investigation? It, it, it is, yeah. We, 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 arrested the, we arrested the suspect the following day. He's currently incarcerated on a $2 million bond. But uh, yeah, it continue to be a lengthy investigation. 